you like RNG and gambling? Hopefully a cool thing in game, no no real money here for the time being. And you want to do it inside of Diablo? Well, got some good news for you because today we are gonna be talking about the Oboz, which I think that's how it pronounced, which is of course a currency you can get inside of Diablo 4 to hopefully get your hands on some wonderful a wonderful loot for your character. But before we get into that, I do want to give a giant thank you to everybody that is supporting over on patreon.com slash macon. Thank you, thank you, my dudes, and of course, thank you as well, a 1k for supporting at the Lunar Teal. But with that, let's go ahead and let's talk some RNG. So, to talk off, of course, at the time of this video, we don't know they're gonna change. There is no way to actually spend real money on this, but keep that in mind, who know down the line. But for the time being, the currency that you can find in your character sheet down here at the bottom white is a currency you can actually get your hands on in a few ways. And of course, one of the most easier ways is to take advantage of, of course, missions or war missions or trials, I guess events, I guess you can call them, that will be popping up all over the map at uh, in votes of time usually five to ten minutes and you will usually uh, know where they are happening because you look at your map you will have a call of uh, this uh, orange little outline here of where you need to go so if you go ahead head over to it and take part in the event and complete whatever it might be you can also get your hands on the orbs by a uh, completing a uh, dungeons as well and once you quill you will have a chance to get the rewarded. There is also a possibility of getting the orb from some quests as well. Uh, but just know it's not every single quest. But that is an option. Either way, once you have your hands on these, you are good to go. But you might be wondering if there is exactly a limit to how much of this you can carry. And the answer is, as of now, yes. Uh, since, well, something changed from now to release, the cap seemed to be about a thousand of these orbs. Uh, so if you get caught to that number, it's probably better to actually spin these. And after spinning these, what we need to do is go ahead and head back into uh, the main uh, city here. And you might be able to find these in some other cities as well. Uh, just know it more likely, mainly just going to be big city from the way it's seen from the beta. But nonetheless, here... We're going to go ahead and we need to find us, of course, a, a little money bag, which you can, of course, find on the map as well. And, of course, once you make it to the little money bag symbol, we're going to go ahead and talk to this NPC. And so, how they're going to operate here, we're going to have a whole bunch of different stuff here. So, we pretty much got every a single item that you can equip, uh, depending on your class here, as well as a Whipple key uh, that you can go ahead and use to unlock chests that you might find in dungeons as well. If you want to go that route and also let on G. But let's just say we're going to go ahead and do that for equipment here. So, let's go ahead and see if we can upgrade one of our stuff. So, in my case, my uh, Grub here is yeah you know, not exactly the highest tier so let's go ahead and find our grubs and as you can see to uh, get us one of the items it's gonna cost 25 of the currency so what's gonna happen is you're gonna pay the 25 and then once you pay the 25 magic in that you are randomly a given an equipment of that type as you can see in my end i actually did get something a way more powerful and i'm just gonna go ahead and equip that real quick and of course, if you want to try your luck again, of course, you can go ahead and do so. So let's try it one more time hmm, and see. Much, is it? And this time, as you can see, I did get a magical glove, which is a lower teal. Uh, so pretty much this is a 100% on G. But like I said, at the time of the video anyway, the currency is 100% free uh, from a completing activity. So, if you are someone who is setting on a whole bunch of this stuff and you just don't feel like going out to try to get item drops, or maybe you are just trying to get your hands on a whole bunch of equipment really quick uh, to you to break down into a uh, weapons upgrade. And if you want to see a video on how to do that, it will be linked above. Uh, but nonetheless, there might be an option for you uh, to see what you can go ahead and uh, get your hands on here. And who knows? Maybe, just maybe. You will actually get something fairly decent 
Oh, Try you know, just like me, just continue having the luck known nice. the man and but then any more mediocre better. luck. But nonetheless, that though is how you go ahead and bend your orbits. Once again, probably butchering that name inside of Diablo 4. And hopefully you have found it video helpful in one way, shape, or form. If so, I'm sure to do the thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss out on any more Diablo 4 uh, videos coming from the channel. Since we will be covering it dramatically since so far the beta have been fantastic other than some issues. But that is a discussion for another day. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on that video or any other guide videos that will be coming for Diablo 4, as I know a lot of you are playing right now and preparing for the open beta net week. And of course, if you do want to come hang out and say hello, you can do so uh, by coming on over to a twitch.tv slash Troy Macon, where I stream every day. And right now, we are doing giant marathons of Diablo 4 for the closed beta. And with that, I will go ahead and see you in the comments.